How's it going everybody? You're watching Then About Tech and today we're going to talk about iOS 17. More specifically, the release dates, the compatible iPhones, and of course, how to install it. So, let's get started. Oh, and by the way, if you want to check the new features and changes of iOS 17, I have a video on the channel, a hands-on overview of iOS 17 running right here on my iPhone 14 Pro. I super recommend that you take a look, card right here, and link in the description. So, as you probably know, Apple unveiled iOS 17 yesterday on WWDC 23 on June 5th. But of course, that's not yet a public release. So let's talk about dates, because those are super important. There are actually three important dates that you have to keep in mind. First, and the reason why I'm already running iOS 17, is because yesterday, just a few hours after the event, Apple released iOS 17 to developers. So then I'm running right here, iOS 17 beta one, the developer version. So that's one information. This is called developer beta and it's actually paid. More on that in a second. Moving on, we also have the public beta, which is date number two. And as the name suggests, the public beta is also a beta. So it's still not the official release, not yet, and it'll be available in July, so in a month for now. The public beta is completely free. And of course, we have the final official release for everyone. So expect iOS 17 to be released to the public as a final stable version in September. So very close to the Apple iPhone event. So we're expecting the final release around the 18th of September. So a little bit over three months from now. Now let's talk about compatible devices. So which iPhones will be compatible to update to iOS 17? And I wanna be very clear on this because unfortunately the iPhones 8, 8 Plus and 10 won't be compatible to iOS 17. So Apple just dropped compatibility to those three devices, okay? So updating the list, now iOS 17 will be compatible only to the iPhones 10R and newer, and that includes the iPhone SE 2 and SE 3. And last but not least, I wanna tell you how you can install iOS 17 beta on your iPhone, and that's why I left it to the end. So, remember when I told you that there were three dates? So, those are really important because right now, and we are recording this on June 6th, the only way you can install iOS 17 on your iPhone is naturally on a beta version, and it's only if you are a registered developer. That's the only way you can install it because right now, we just have the developer beta. And as I said, the developer beta is paid because in order to have access to it, you need to be a registered developer and that's $100 a year. So that's the only way you can install iOS 17 beta on your iPhone. Of course, I'm talking about officially and legally. There are other ways, but I don't recommend they're not legal and you may create a problem on your iPhone, on your Apple ID. It's just illegal and I don't recommend. So right now, the only way you can install it is if you pay and if you are a registered developer. Now, a little bit later on, as I mentioned on June 10th, everyone that wants to get a iOS 17 beta version on their iPhone will be able to do it through the public beta, which is free, so everyone can do it. And of course, as soon as Apple releases it, I'm gonna have a video here on the channel teaching you step-by-step step how to legally install the public beta on your iPhone. But right now, unfortunately, we can't. And of course, later on in September, you're gonna have the final version on your iPhone normally as you get all iOS updates through the air, okay? So, that's it. This is the information I wanna give it to you today. And thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video as usual, guys. Bye-bye.